Look at that. Mother Nature right on time. Today is the first day of spring. Look how the flowers is on schedule. Look. See how they do? Amazing, right? Look. Hey there, flower. Hello there. First day of spring, they, they already popped. So y'all know what I'm out here doing. I'm just out here enjoying nature, doing what I do. But um, this is the Traders Vlog. Mark Fuller, Team Alliance. Um, this is my slow and steady project account. You can see the time. The time right now is 5.39 p.m. And um, I'm just logging in to show you guys something um, about the account that has taken place this week so far. So I've actually taken a couple of trades this week. And the pace that I'm trying to set is one trade per week. All things being considered, last week I didn't take a trade. So this week I actually took a couple of trades. Right, actually I took a few trades to be honest. Um, so I think right now I'm already in position to scale up to the next contract size based on um, the account size. Let me just show you what I'm talking about. So if I actually go to where is it? Right there. Yeah. So if you look at this. You can see 172. Let me zoom in. Right there, 172. You see the contract size? Two contracts. So I'm in position now to scale up to the next contract size, which is two contracts, which represents um, on the next trade, actually going to be trade number five. So I'm already up to trade number four i've taken four trades so far um for the project i know it hasn't been four weeks it's been more like i guess maybe three weeks two weeks three weeks whatever it is but in any case i'm gonna you know as i mentioned try to keep everything paced at one trade per week beast mode you know what it is ta baby yeah i'm gonna try to keep everything um paste that one trade each week um you know for purposes of the project the slow and steady project but that's where i'm at right now 171 uh market is closed right now it opens in another 20 minutes or so and then we'll be you know observing and we'll be doing training tonight and all the good stuff so i just got finished doing a, a youtube live just now actually i just saw a squirrel Where's my squirrel guy? Where's my squirrel friend at? He hiding from me. I also saw, I saw a red robin too. He was perched over there on that branch. But anyway, um, so, yeah, I just did the, the, uh, the YouTube live. It was a very good YouTube live um, talking about the misconceptions of trading. And, um, you know, there are many uh, misconceptions out there about trading in general and with what we do specifically the niche that we're in you know being on the natives platform and trading the binaries that's a very specific thing to be in position to do and uh, let me take a walk up here real quick i won't walk too far because i'm kind of illegally parked but yeah it's a very specific thing to do um however The misconception about trading in general, I think, one of the biggest ones is that, you know, when you are positioning yourself to take trades, uh, that you don't necessarily need a skill set. People feel like signals and strategies are enough. You know, they feel like that's all they need is a, is a strategy of some type. But that's not true. That's not the case at all. 
And I wish I had a way to turn the camera around while I'm recording, but I don't, so I'm just recording whatever as I'm talking. But um, yeah, you, you need way more than signals and strategies. Like, it's gonna take more than that for you to position yourself to be able to trade. And that's one of the reasons why I'm putting out so much content, you know, so much information. I'm vlogging, doing live streams, doing my normal content, I'm doing projects. You know, there's a lot because I feel like I want to be a contribution to all of the misconceptions being broken down and busted through. Like this is way too many misconceptions out there about what trading is. I'll just walk over here real quick. Take a look at the highway. Way too many misconceptions about what trading actually is. So that's one of the things that, you know, is my goal is to break that down and to help people just to become more educated and aware of what trading really is all about. There goes squirrel right there. See him running? Yep. My little squirrel friend. Yeah, so you know, that's what it is. So you guys, you know, y'all stay connected to the vlog. You know, stay connected to the live streams on YouTube and all of that good stuff. And just continue to educate and become more well informed about what it actually takes to, to trade for a living and to have trading serve you as a business, you know, versus the misconceptions that so many people have about what trading actually is, because the misconceptions have got to be broken down. Oh, I think that's the Robin right there. Wait, let me see if I can zoom in on him. Is that him? No, that ain't him. I just saw a bird over there, but I don't think that was him. Is that him? Yeah, that's him. That's one of them. You see him? You over there hiding behind them leaves over there. I see you, bro. I see you, man. Yeah, but anyway, so yeah, yeah, stay tuned, man. You know, more to come. As always, Mark full of Team Alliance. First day of spring. Um, I'm going to shoot over to IGTV real quick, do a little quick um, vlog for there, and then I'm out. I'm going to get ready for training later tonight. Hopefully the software will be working properly, and we won't have any issues, and we'll be good to go. All right? Mark full of Team Alliance. Deuces.